What is going on guys, it is Tech Simulator and in this video we'll be talking about this new mouse that I found, it's called the Entertainment Ti uh, Tech Mouse and it's a wireless mouse and it works at 2.4 gigahertz and it's an optical mouse obviously and it's actually from a Chinese company but I've been using this for the past two months and actually like the performance of this mouse so I wanted to show you guys if you guys were interested and they could buy it from the link down in the uh, description and there will be a 10% discount from my name if you put down the promo code at the end of this video so this mouse is actually pretty nice and if connecting it to a computer you can connect it up to three devices at once and connecting it to a computer will allow it to light up so it will be lighting up and over here if it's red it will tell you that it's connected and if it's blinking red then it's obviously not connected and the blue lights will show when it's connected and you're able to use the mouse this mouse can be used from both sides as it is equal so a left hand or right handed person could use this very easily and it's pretty swift with any computer or anything I've even used it on my iMac not just on Windows PCs but it's pretty sleek so I really like the performance of this mouse Look at the price of it, it's only priced at £13, so looking at the price is pretty cheap, but the aesthetics are very comfortable when you could tell that by, by every single angle. The buttons are slightly fingerprint magnet and uh, they're easily to break I guess, but the, it's not that robust, I can tell by the quality of it. But at the bottom you'll find a USB, which is like this, so it's a mini USB that you connect to the back of your computer or wherever you want to connect to it and then you'll be able to use the mouse at the bottom of this mouse you'll be able to use the mouse which through this USB that you'll be able to connect through the back of, the back of your iMac or wherever you want to connect to maybe on a laptop or the right hand side or left hand side USB slots and then you'll be able to use it so let's look at the bottom layout this is the main two uh, buttons that you'll be using for right and left click or vice versa for whatever hand you are the scroll buttons, the two connectivity buttons for the main two connections. I think it's only two connections, I might be wrong. Um, also the on button, the off button and the on with the light button. So you'll be, you'll be able to use the lights. If you don't want the lights and you want to save your battery then you may as well. Your main optical part. It is a 1.5V which is 6.8 milliamps. Which is not that bad in terms of power consumption. But looking at this it only uses one battery. Which is something that so only power efficient mouses will be able to use. So this only uses one battery to be able to use for about three months, as it says on the box. I maybe not have unboxed this mouse, but looking at the mouse, it's pretty sleek, and I really like the performance of it. And I can say that as much as I want, because it is really performative. If you want to use a mouse that that performs as much as any other good mouse and not as pricey as the Logitech, then you might as well go for this. So looking at the, the the button layout, you'll see that there's uh, the left and right clicks or vice versa for whatever I am you are or whatever, let's say you're left handed or right handed. And also this is the, the scroll button, the two connectivity ports that you can connect it to two different devices at the same time if you, as in two different devices. Um, also this, that's where it reads um, whatever your on button for just the on without the lights this is the off and then you could throw it to the on with the lights which just means that you'll be able to use it with lights on it which looks pretty nice you should actually try it, try it if you buy it um, the USB place where we got the USB from uh, those are the two buttons if you want to go back and forward and yeah that's pretty much it so please do hit the, uh, the like button for this review if you really did like it and it was good for you otherwise um, you. So please hit that subscribe button if you want more content like this and peace.